If you wish to make an apple pie from scratch, uh, uh, you must first invent the universe. <laughs> Uh, space is filled with a network of wormholes. Uh, you might emerge somewhere else in space, uh, someone else in time. Uh, the sky calls to us. If we do not destroy ourselves, we will one day venture to the stars. A still more glorious dawn awaits. Not a sunrise, but a galaxy rise. A morning filled with 400 billion suns. The rising of the Milky Way. The cosmos is full beyond measure of elegant truths, of exquisite interrelationships, of the awesome machinery of nature. I believe our future depends powerfully on how well we understand this cosmos in which we float. <laughs> like a moat of dust in the morning sky. But, but, but the brain does much more than just recollect. Um, it intercompares, it synthesizes, it analyzes. Um, uh, it generates abstraction. Um, the, the, the simplest thought, like the concept of the number one, um, it has an elaborate logical underpinning. I mean, the brain has its own language, uh, for, for testing and, and for, and for structure and, um, like consistency of the world. A still more glorious dawn awaits, not a sunrise, but a galaxy rise, a morning filled with 400 billion suns, the rising of the Milky Way. The sky calls to us, if we do not destroy ourselves, we will one day venture to the stars. For thousands of years, people have wondered about the universe. Did it stretch out forever? Or was there a limit? From the Big Bang to the black hole, uh, to black holes, oh, from dark matter to a possible big crunch. Our image of the universe today is full of strange sounding ideas. How lucky we are to live in this time, uh, the first moment in human history when we are in fact visiting other worlds. A still more glorious dawn awaits, not a sunrise, but a galaxy rise, a morning filled with 400 billion suns, the rising of the Milky Way. A still more glorious dawn awaits, not a sunrise, but a galaxy rise, a morning filled with 400 billion suns, the rising of the Milky Way. The surface of the Earth is the shore of the cosmic ocean. Recently, we've waded a little way out and the water seems inviting.